What's up, my dude? Your friendly neighborhood Tony here, and we are going to check out today the first official trailer for the upcoming Godzilla and King Kong movie. This one's called Godzilla X Kong The New Empire, and it's the latest movie in the monster universe, the American Godzilla and King Kong series that's been going on for a few years. It's set to come out in April, and with the recent release of Godzilla Minus One, which I've reviewed on my channel, will the American Monsterverse live up to the same level of quality as what they're doing in Japan right now with Godzilla? Well, there's only one way to find out. So let's jump on real quick we'll watch the first official trailer together then we'll talk a little bit about the movie to see if it looks like this one's going to be any good if that kind of thing sounds cool to you and you want to keep up to speed on all the new big movies that are coming out in theaters and on streaming make sure you subscribe all right without further ado the first official trailer for godzilla x kong the new empire here we go Okay. For most of human civilization, we believed that life could only exist on the surface of our planet. Okay, so they're continuing with that core of the planet thing that they kind of addressed in the last movie. Uh, look like a transformer. <laughs> what else were we wrong about? Well, Ah, here we go. Won't you come on in? This world has more secrets than we could possibly imagine. Miracles I, I like the visuals. The CG, the bright Still colors and everything. Now and then. Oh. Oh. Is what that Diddy Kong? Is that? Just kidding. That's not Kong. Who could have done this? Dun dun dun. Oh. Got the whole squad. Okay. Kong can't stop this on his own. He won't be alone. Very, very curious to see how the story ends up being. That looks dope. Little team up action. Well, what is, what's with the arm though? I, I don't remember that from the prior movies. Why does he have like armor on one arm? Is that a mini Kong? <laughs> okay. Uh, apparently oh, filmed for IMAX. So, all right. Definitely going to try to see that on the biggest screen possible. That looks pretty good. I'm, you know. A little unsure, right? With the American MonsterVerse, King Kong slash Godzilla movies. I've liked, I think, most of them, but, you know, they, they've been a little hit and miss. So, you know, visually, it looks cool. I like the idea of this kind of different world at the center of the earth where all of these giant monsters come from. I think it's a really cool concept. And, you know, of course, who doesn't love to see King Kong and Godzilla just wrecking shop? I just worry that the story isn't going to hold up. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. I'm definitely going to watch this as soon as it comes out in theaters. And it looks like it's being directed by Adam Wingard, who is the same person that directed uh, Godzilla versus Kong, which I liked that one. I know some people were a little mixed as far as Godzilla versus Kong is concerned. I think for me, if I think back, the only one of those three Godzilla movies that I didn't really care for was the second one, which I think was Godzilla King of the Monsters. But, you know, that's just my personal opinion. I'm sure everybody's going to have different perspectives on that. Now, as far as the premise of this movie is concerned, I mean, I think we got a lot of it from the trailer, but Warner Brothers and Legendary, which are the studios that are making and producing this movie, 
They have a little bit of a quote here. It says here, this latest entry follows up the explosive showdown of Godzilla versus Kong with an all new cinematic adventure, pitting the almighty Kong and the fearsome Godzilla against a colossal undiscovered threat hidden within our world challenging their very existence and our own. The epic new film will delve further into the histories of these titans, their origins, and the mysteries of Skull Island and beyond, while uncovering the mythic battle that helped forge these extraordinary beings and tied them to humankind forever. So it looks like it's going to explore a little bit more of the history of Skull Island and of... Uh, is Skull Island that entire world within the world or is it a specific part of that i don't know i, I might have to go back and rewatch these movies to be honest with you but let me know what your thoughts are on this i just recently watched godzilla minus one and i absolutely loved that movie so if you want to see my review of that i'll link it at the very end of the video over here but i don't think i've ever really been in love with any of the american versions of godzilla or any of these kind of monster movies so hopefully this one will stand out i mean i don't hate any of them i just haven't been a massive fan of the franchise but let me know what you think in the comments below are you really looking forward to godzilla x kong the new empire and what did you think of the other monster verse movies that they've come out with so far which ones are your favorites which ones do you not like honestly at this point i'm really looking forward to the next japanese version of godzilla but hopefully this one will tide me over until then i guess so yeah let me know your thoughts in the comments below and of course if you want to keep up to speed on all the new big movies that are coming out, make sure you subscribe. All right, my dude, I'll catch you in the next one. Be good.